Matthew here from MiniWargaming.com with Mini Wargamer Dave and Mini Wargamer Steve, and it's time for another World Engine 40k narrative campaign bet rap. We work so you can play. Mini Wargaming's the World Engine. This is Mission 2A. If you haven't yet watched the story time for this, I strongly recommend that you do because there's a lot of new story elements that are added. And while you can enjoy the battle report without the story, it definitely adds a new level of awesomeness to it. And the story time will be in a link in the video description below. In this one, we have Davicus and his forces who have broken out of prison thanks to the power failures of this tomb world. And uh, he's relayed instructions over to the other group, uh, led by Captain Antara, which we'll see in Mission 2B, as well as Commissar Khrushchev. I usually be fighting against him, though. No, no not I for know, him. I That's know. the bittersweet thing of <laughs> playing so many sides, so eventually you play against yourself. And in this one, we have a fight over a generator room that Davicus and his forces are trying to disable in the hopes that it will disrupt the power sources enough. So it's a smaller game because it's actually just the remnants of last game. So it's about 800 points, give or take 50 points. And uh, you'll see some illegal sized squads, like three Terminators instead of five. And that is perfectly okay. It's like super unbound. It's narrative campaign. It's like do whatever you want because we're allowed to do it and we make our own rules. So that's what we like. So let's take a look at the mission as well as the armies. And here is a scenario that we're playing. We're going to play on a 4x4 four four table to represent the smaller forces and the more confined spaces. Once again, all this terrain is created by Brush for Hire. You can actually purchase it by going to their website, brushforhire.com. I think it's all available right now, or shortly will be by the time you watch this. And the table was created by Ash. He was kind enough to create a table for us so it looks like the interior of a tomb world. And what do we have here? We have 800 points of Necrons versus 800 points of Space Marines in basically an objective battle. They all deployed already. Necrons deployed first, and then the Space Marines deployed second, and then we're gonna roll to see who gets to go first. So on the Necron side, we have a 10-man squad of warriors, a spider with four Scarab Swarms, another spider with four Scarab Swarms, a 10-man squad of Immortals with Tesla, and then we have a Lum, not Illuminator. Yes, yeah, Illuminator Caesaris, that's what it is. This is the special cryptic that you heard of in the story time, so he actually is here. And he gives mechanical augmentations to one group of immortals or warriors, and Steve chose this group and rolled a die, and they got plus one ballistic skill. So they are all ballistic skill five, hitting on two pluses, which is pretty awesome. And he is basically just a cryptic with a three plus save and a few more attacks. And he has the Eldritch Lance, which is a strength 8 AP2 36 inch range weapon, and Gaze of Flame, which gives him and his squad defensive grenades. And he also has one of the sentry pylons, which are, we're using the same stats from the last game that we played with them. Now there are two on this board, and Steve does not know which one is actually operational. You see, the Necron Tomb World is having power issues, so one of these is not going to work. And we're not going to know which one doesn't work until Steve tries to fire one of them. And that one will have a 50-50 chance of being the one that is not operational. And if it is the one that is operational, then the other one automatically is not operational and is immediately destroyed, although it'll still stay there as a piece of scenery. On top of that, for our objectives, we've got one, two, three, four, five objectives, but some of them are actually not objectives. So at the end of turn one, we're gonna randomly determine two of the smaller ones to actually be objectives. So we don't know which ones are still operational because it's just all gonna be random. On the Space Marine side, what we have is a leftover of the Stern Guard squad. So we have five out of 10 that were there last game. And they're all armed with their combi weapons, but they've already used all their combi weapons. So they just count as bolters. We have our three-man Terminator Assault Squad, which of course is an illegal squad, but we're just gonna make it work because we want to. And Davicus is joining them with, of course, his awesome spear and all of the other stuff. But Davicus is minorly wounded, which gives him minus one weapon skill and ballistic skill for this mission, which won't affect him too much in his case because his weapon skill will still be higher than all the Necrons that he'll be facing in this one. We have the remnants of the scout squad, and one of them was able to find a leftover missile launcher from one of the dead tactical Marines, and he took that one, and the rest of them still have their sniper rifles. And then we have another tactical squad down here, and this one has how many guys in it? Is it nine? Is it it's the full 10-man squad. There were three tactical squads, and now there's just two. And it's really just one and a half. So they have a missile launcher and a flamer. And then this tactical squad has a flamer. And it's just a five-man squad to represent the, the survivors. 
and all of the sergeants are veteran sergeants and have melta bombs which won't be too useful in the mission except against the spiders but it's more to represent the equipment that they found that they're going to use to try to destroy the generators once they're able to capture them. So it's as simple as that. We're going to roll the sea goes first. It's going to be random game length and a couple of the objectives are going to disappear. We don't know which ones yet. And that was kind of inspired by a steamroller turn or scenario from War Machine. And we don't know which one of these guns is not operational. Other than that, it's going to play out as a normal mission. No night fighting. And there is First Blood and Slay the Warlord as secondary objectives. So objectives are worth two victory points and the secondary objectives are worth one victory point each. Roll off to see who gets to choose who goes first. And Steve, you choose who goes first. I am I'm gonna go first. All right. Necrons, turn one. Change your mind? I'm gonna make Dave go first. All right. Why? I need you to come to me. I have short range well, guns. If I don't want to. What if yes. your objectives are moot? Then I want you to come to me. That's why I want you to go first. Yeah, that's why, right? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I can stay where I am. Really? Yeah. Turn one, we just face this. That's right. Then we're gonna see. Okay, start of turn two, and then use a gun. Oh, but we see which objectives are actually objectives. That's true. Right. So Space Marines, turn one. Terminators are gonna move up, even though I don't know what is an objective and what is not at this point. Well, we're guaranteed that this one's an objective. All the other ones, you're not sure yet. And the tactical Marines underneath, they're gonna move up, except for the missile launcher. He's gonna stay put. So the snipers, they're going to shoot against this. I don't know if it's actually functional, but we'll soon find out. So let's do five of the rifles first. Four is to hit. Actually, one of them, oh, we should have, heck, it doesn't matter, he rolled a two. But one of them is a sergeant who has a better blisses skill. But in this case, he rolled all five pluses. Four is to, glan or four is to wound, and six is our AP2. So it has three wounds. Two of them, it gets no armor saves, and one, it gets a three plus. Three plus! It's good. Down to one wound. And I'm going to shoot the missile launcher. No. Misses. Of course. The bolters from that squad right there are going to fire onto that. Hitting on threes. Ooh. Wounding on sixes. Nothing. Missile launcher underneath there is going to fire at this spider. Threes yeah. to hit. And then twos to wound. Wound. Four up cover. He's fine. Stern guard, they're going to use their uh, special rounds where it's AP3. And they're going to fire at this, because they got really nothing else to fire at. And I'm going to fire the four regular ones first, and the sergeant I'll do after. Yeah, because the air gets hot. Oh, so, three hits. Get hot. Save. Oh, oh, one goes down. His weapon explodes in his face. Six is to wound. Nothing, nothing, and nothing. And the sergeant. It's a hit, and sixes. Nope. I'm going to run this squad. One inch. Yay. Just enough to go under there. And yes, he had a Space Marine turn one, so they managed to take two wounds off of this one, so Dave is crossing his fingers and hoping that that's the one that's actually it, but we won't find out yet. And he lost a stern guard to his ammunition exploding in his face, so he's either dead or temporarily out of the game because his weapon no longer works. Necrons, turn one. The spiders are going to add more scarab swarms. Do they lose a wound? No. And no. Boom. Scarabs, scuttle forward. Getting close to those Terminators. And the warriors advance. Need to drive off these pesky space marines. These guys, remember, all have blitz of skill five. So they're going to be hitting on fives. The six is being three hits. It's nasty. The other spider advances as well. These scarabs are going to just move a little bit. Obviously, he wants to stick around and be able to add more next turn. Shoot you, phase. You want to fire this one? You think choosing the one that's not wounded will, will grant you more luck? On a four plus, that one is operational. So that one is not operational. This one is, which is already down to a wound. Ooh. Thanks, Steve. I'm, I'm happy. Yay, first good die roll. <laughs> and this one is going to power up and fire into the snipers. Hit on threes. And wounding on twos. One wound. The four up cover save plus one. Ah, oh, that's a dead one. So the nearest dies. Running the immortals with the Tesla weapons. 
Oh, just an inch. These warriors are gonna open fire on the Terminators. Threes to hit! Oh, ho, 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 10 hits! First wound! Nasty. So we got five wounds. Everybody's two plus saves. Oh! Whoa. Negate luck with luck. Okay. Okay. It's running these scarabs. Because he's afraid of charging a guy who has a flamer and a strength six weapon that can insta kill them. He's gonna back them off just a hair. <laughs> this spider is gonna fire its twin linked particle beamer, I think is what it's Caster. called. Caster at this one. Here we are. Scatter. And it scatters four inches, which will be two, three, four. Not quite enough to hit his own guy, though. Which doesn't matter. That's just a piece of scenery now. So that is the end of turn one altogether. So it's time to find out which objectives are not objectives. So this is going to work is we're going to do one, two, three, four. Reroll fives and sixes. Go ahead. Number one. This is what it is going to be. So one, two, three, four. So this is an objective as well as roll again. We need a one, two, or three. One, two, or three. I guess we could do a D3. Come on, just get a one, two, or three. One. So it's that one. Oh, look at that. Perfect. One over there and one over here are actually objectives. These ones are no longer objectives. Space Marine, turn two. Well, guys, I think this one's already toasted. Let's go after something else. And leave Gary behind with his broken bolter. Okay, we're just going to lift this thing off temporarily. Oh, these guys move forward. Why didn't we do this before? Because it would have been smart. And it's early in the morning. Ooh, hold on. Yeah. Ooh, Terminators are advancing. I saw what you did there. What? I said it like Arnold? Yes. Terminators. No, that was bad. No, that was pretty that was, bad. That was that, horrible. That was, you should delete that clip. Yeah, sorry. Not a Tuma. So this tactical squad under here is going to rapid fire as much as they can into the Scarab Swarm. 16 dice, bolters hitting on threes. Ooh. His was perfect. Yeah, wounding on threes. So four up cover for all of them. Ooh, one base goes down. Maybe this guy, because he can't see the other one. So I can fire the uh, frag, but in retrospect, I probably should have done this first because it would have covered more, but we learn. Scatter, one inch. Yeah, one. Actually, it's probably perfect. You hit three of them. I said three. So threes to wound, and those are doubled. So it doesn't become six wounds. We're going to roll the saves first, because it'll still be four up cover. And so that Ooh. becomes, that's easy, two wounds. So that guy goes on the one wound. Dabicus is going to fire his bolt pistol, because his flamer can't, because his terminator buddies are in front of him. Now he's down one ballistic skill, so he's only hitting on threes instead of twos. Still hits, and fails to wound. So the scouts are going to fire at this again. It's going to roll for the regular scouts first. Hitting on fours. Oh, precision shots, which doesn't matter in this case, but it looks impressive. Forced to wound. Two wounds with his regular three up save. Can you do it? Woo! And it goes down. First blood! First blood! First blood! You won first. First won. blood. First. first blood. Yeah, this is turn two. Nobody got first turn one. <laughs> it's pretty sad. Tactical Marines are going to fire onto uh, these guys. <laughs> Why not? Threes to hit. Fours and to wound. Fours to wound. Ooh, three wounds. These are my dice. Three up. Oh. oh. Sure, they don't care. Those. Whatever. I'm going to run those guys. An inch. Wow. I think every single run in this game so far has been an inch. Hey, seriously, the Terminators yeah. ran an inch. The Scarab Swarms ran an inch. Yeah. Those guys ran an inch. And they ran an inch. Four for four. It's a lot of inches. Terminator squad there with Abacus, they're declaring an assault against the Scarab Swarms who can't fire Overwatch. They can stare at you menacingly. How does that look? What is a Scarab Swarm? No. <laughs> that's a Scarab Swarm! That's a smile! <laughs> Scar Scarab Swarm! <laughs> you can't see the man no. when he's really... No, no, no. He's turning red, he's laughing so hard. No, no, no. You know, that was the best Scarab There we go. He's like puckering for a kiss. <laughs> Come on, guys. <laughs> You're gonna get in no matter what. Six inches, just make sure everybody <laughs> does get in. Careful of your words. That's not always the case. Yeah, yeah. Double one. You're you're like an inch away. So yeah, yeah but if there's in terrain, then three inches. But it's not. That's why I'm saying you're gonna get in no matter what. <laughs> it's all good. Uh, yeah, I can. Go you can wrap around. Can wrap around. Davicus is gonna go first. He's got the highest initiative. He's I got, got four a spear. Attacks. Big spear. 
Hitting on threes, re-rolling one, because it is master crafted, and that's a good thing. And because of a special ability, I also get to re-roll a wound, but uh, that's a wound anyway. Yeah, it is digital weapons. So that's two instant deaths. You have to kill the one that's already hurt, and then one more. Oh, sweet. Terminator's initiative step pile in move. Terminator's threes to hit. Not bad. And threes, re-rolling, because of shred, and hopefully, Yep. You make all these. Crap! No, no, they're AP3. They're, they're dead. dead. Ah, I wanted you to survive so that you don't have to shoot me in your turn. You mean you're shooting me. This is rapid fire tons of gauss that killed them last time. Consolidate! Hey, more than one inch! I'm gonna go right where I should be. Guarding this objective. And that is the end of Space Marines turn two. So moving forward, managed to eradicate that one Scarab Swarm squad with ease. And then Davicus and his Terminators are moving over to prepare to hold this objective as the Stern Guard move away from the one that they realize is already malfunctioning, so they don't need to put a Melta Bomb on it at the end of the game. And finishing off the emplacement, which is a big deal because last game that is basically what held the ground in Mission 1B, so it's nice to see it go while ever the tactical squad advances and tries to start to move forward into that corner to grab that objective as well. So. And first blood for Space Marines. So the score is currently, like, if, forgetting objectives right now because we don't know who's going to have them at the end, the score is one nothing as we go into Necrons turn two. Spawning Scarab Forms, that one, they're both good. Oh, warriors moving away from the malfunction one, receive new protocols from the CPU processors, from all the command elements. Really just as Sarah says, tells them to come on over here to actually try to protect the generators that are still working. Scarab swarms are shuffling. Do the shuffle! Oh, and the immortals are moving sideways. Looks like everybody cares about the middle objective, which I guess makes kind of sense. Or kind of makes sense. Come to Papa. Eldritch Lanch, Lance, <laughs> Lanch, the Lanch is gonna fire at the Terminator, sir. Hitting on a three. Hey, he hit! My Cryptex never no, hit my, with their my, Eldritch Lanch. My Lance never hit anything, actually. No. That's the first one. Moving on twos. Never hit anything. Yeah, that's a wound. Five up in Vaughn. Ooh, that would have been a failed Terminator armor save. So Terminator dies. Splat. And then the ten Tesla shots into them. Hitting on twos, sixes are three hits, so that makes up for those two ones. So ten hits, <laughs> wounding <laughs> on fours. Threes. Oh, like threes, just trying to climb this, right. Jeez. Two oh, wait, plus wait, wait, wait. armor. What, 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 what? Davis will take wounds after two. Oh, they're there. all two plus. He has two up as well. They're, they're all two plus, okay. we roll them all at once. And one wound, one Terminator dies. Ouch, two Terminators to one shooting squad. Now mind you, it's with the Cesaris in there. And then the warriors are going to open fire, some of them rapid firing. Threes to hit. Ooh, lots of ones and twos. Or lots of ones, and a little bit too. Fours to wound. Oh, lots. How do you get through two plus saves? Oh, not like that, apparently. This guy's going to fire his blast weapon into this squad, targeting right about here. It's got her. That's a direct hit. We got three hits. Twos to wound. Three wounds. Three wounds. Three up armor saves. They're good. The other spider is going to fire at the same squad. Great one. And it scatters three inches. Hits two of them. Two's to wound. Two wounds. Three up armor. Oh, one more goes down. One tactical marine at the front. So morale check on Davicus's squad. They are fine. And no assaults declared. So at the end of Necrons, turn two, turn two altogether. A couple terminators did go down, which is not a small thing and one tactical marine, but did manage to weather the storm of a lot of other shooting attacks, so that is good for the space marines. As we go into space marines, turn three. Terminators going forward. See so if they can engage those warriors. Stern guard, they're gonna move six inches into this direction, because they're useless over here. Tactical marines are gonna move up six inches. Weep. That works. That makes it easier. So tactical marines are gonna fire at this spider because I want to be able to de-birth. De-birth? Birthing abilities. 
because I'm tired. I think it's more of a create type thing where it just is kind of it like a falls creation? Off yeah, them. falls out. Like what, what exactly is falling out here? Scarabs. Scarabs are. <laughs> and then they come back and kill the advocates. Both All right. And on threes. What do you on sixes? Nothing. Yeah. That fire the crack. Oh. Whoa! Hit, hit. Whoa. Twos. Hey, it's a wound. Four, Four up cover. Bail, bail, bail. Oh, no, 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 no. no luck. Snipers are going to fire into that spider. Regular, regular snipers first. Oh, no. miss. Sergeant. Hit. hit. And he wounds on a four. It's a wound. Three up armor. He's good. Missile launcher. That's a hit. And that's a wound. Four up cover. Oh, he finally takes a wound. And he's down to two. Stern guard are going to run. Hey, it wasn't a one inch run. Congratulations, Stern guard. You actually ran rather than shuffle. Davicus will flame five of those Necron warriors. So this is a heavy flamer, so wounds on threes, no saves, three die. Toasty, toasty. Burnt metal. Doesn't matter, just grab one. Land of shooting phase morale test on the warriors. They are fine. Three animations on a five plus. One comes back. So declaring a charge. Gonna need five, they overwatch first. 16 shots in on sixes. Ooh, four hits. Four is to wound. Two wounds. Two plus save. You're good. Finch charge. Whoa, ten. A little eager, aren't we? Hammer of Wrath is illegal, but I think I can do it. No. The so Davicus so. versus five attacks it on threes. Rerolling one, Master Crafted. Four attacks. Sorry, four attacks. And wounded on twos, rerolling one. So three wounds. That's just three dead. So three closest. Go down. Terminator goes in and he gets his four attack. Four is to hit. And four is to wound re-rolling. No saves against those either. Nasty. And then the warriors go in and they do their attacks. Four is to hit. Nothing. Nothing. So the warriors lost by six, so their leadership is four. And they run. You can't overrun them, but Dav actually Dav oh, is yeah, part of the squad. Part of the same squad. Yeah, so they can't. So he doesn't get to reanimate any of these, but those two are going to run. So how far do they run? Eight inches. Consolidate. Two inches. Enemy! So if you're within... Oh, hold on. <laughs> Other way around. Yeah, let's do that. And that is the end of Space Brain's turn three. So Davicus, with his Terminators, charged up, flamed a bunch of warriors, jumped right in and just tore them up. And the two that were surviving did a tactical retreat. As their program said, if you want to survive, you will move away from this monster of a man. And they started running. And so nobody gets to reanimate there, unfortunately for him. As we go into Necrons, turn three. So at the beginning of Necron, turn three. Oh, rally. They do not, because they're at Bleep Ship 2 right now. Or they have to roll double ones. And they run four inches, which actually keeps them on the table. Never know, they might turn around and do something. Spawning more Scarab Swarms. Do they lose any wounds? No. Oh, the rule is two Yeah, you can't combo line it. They have to be within... There we go. Oh, this guy. Okay. And they're going after Davicus. Please do. Are they going to dismantle him into little pieces? Please That's try. the plan. Whoa, inch away. Whoa, whoa. Personal space bubble. Whoa. Oh, yeah, you got one. <laughs> That's true, I don't. Want a couple? <laughs> the spiders keep moving closer so they can make more scarab swarms. Um, I'm just gonna shuffle these guys over. I like the shuffle. I like how you can see. These guys are firing at the tactical marines. Start the lance. He hits. Wounds on a two. It's a wound. Four up cover. It's good. Sorry, my bad. There's no cover on that guy out front, so he just dies. Then all the Tesla. Ones and twos. Hitting on twos. Threes. No, they're augmented. All oh, right, they are. So twos, and that <laughs> six is three. So 12 out of 10 hits. Wounding on threes. That's a lot of wounds. Three up save. One, two, three die. Three die. So you can't see the front three guys, so from the fifth guy back, it's one, two, three. Oh, don't lose the missile launcher. And these guys will snap fire into them because they're running away. One's in rapid fire range, hit on sixes. Oh, jeez. Four is the wound. One wound. Do up armor. 
<laughs> they killed Good the job, guys. They killed the Terminator. Oh, Davicus is all by himself. He's a lone wolf. Poor guy. Is that a wolf? Oh, he's, he's a wolf. He's a salamander. He's, he's a, a he's a lone lizard. He's no longer a lizard. He's a wolf, and he eats lizards. Okay. Rel Rel test. Test. Again, they're good. Have a kiss. <gasps> He's running! No! Actually, that's good for you. I, I don't want you to run. You'll still catch him. It's only four inches. Maybe. <laughs> I need if you roll up. One, two, two, three, four. Oh, he's supposed to run. Yeah, you can catch him just fine. And the scarabs aren't going to assault. Yes. I forgot to run my spider. Can't assault. Well, you can. Just clarify. Well, no. I, he's I, allowed to. I can. Doesn't want it's to. It's not smart to assault right now. Got it. So that is the end of turn three. So the Terminator goes down. Davicus tactically retreats back into some cover. Didn't run, because Space Marines don't run. And the other Space Marine tactical squad took a walloping from the Immortal squad, who seems to be killing lots of stuff. It's killing Terminators, killing tactical squads. They're doing really well. And we're going to go into Space Marines, turn four. All right, Davicus is going to come out, and he's going to look menacing. Actually, you know what? I don't really care about the spider. So I'm gonna go, I'm gonna move back here so I cover the most with my heavy flamer. So tactical marines are gonna move six inches. Yeah, the one missile launcher back there, gotta get into coherency. You can't, you'll hit your own guy. No, that's why. Okay, missile launcher, he's gonna move up and this guy will be there. I'm moving them up underneath. Because Steve loves it. Davicus, Heavy Flamer, six scarabs. Watch this. Twos! Just Five. one, one. So it kills two, and one takes two wounds. Like Unfortunately, the wounds. extra wounds, like this is two wounds plus two, but that's one scarab base, one scarab base, and then two wounds. Snipers are going to fire at that spider that's already wounded. Put the sergeant first, just uh, as good luck, and uh, that's a wound. Free up armor. Good. Get a sniper on a four up. Oh. Miss. Missile launcher. A four up. Oh. This flamer in the tactical squad covers two. Fours to wound. Fours two wounds. Two. Three up armor. They're good. And bolt four. pistols from everybody else. Three up. It's two. And fours. Nothing. And four bolter shots into the immortals right there, hitting on threes. What do you want? Fours? One. One. Up. Oh, he stays alive. Stern guard underneath there, they're gonna run four inches. Uh, yes, that was all. Lance, overwatch. Oh, two to wound. Oh no, that's a dead guy right away. And everything else is Tesla, so six is a hit, but they're three hits each. With two of them, so six hits. Three. Threes to wound. <laughs> Four wounds. Three up armor. Oh! Okay, that makes up for it. You need a seven inch charge. Dude. Otherwise, you just lost a guy for nothing. Oh, you got, got it. it. You got it. I should roll up my eyes closed more often. Yeah. <laughs> Probably with pile in. get those two. Yeah, ten inches will get everybody, plus the pile in. And Davicus is going to charge. He's a four inch charge. That makes it. No problemo. This Fire this move. attack. This is, this is tricky because they only have eight attacks against their 10 plus four, but if they can tarp at these guys, it'll be a lot of firepower not being fired. Hitting on fours. Not bad. On mm -hmm. fours. Three wounds. Three up armor. Fails oh. just one of them. So that's one less attack back. Everything else is initiative two. So yeah. And Cesaris is the same weapon skills we can do at the same time. That's true. 13 attacks back, hitting on fours. Oh, that was above average. On fours. Oh, about average. Three up armor. Oh, you lost two. Which, and combat. So, which means you lost combat by one, and you've lost your veteran sergeant already, so your leadership is down to eight, down to seven. And you're good. Whoa! Oh, tar pitted. At least for one turn. That's awesome. Probably only one turn. <laughs> Reanimation on the one immortal? Nope, he's gone. And Davicus right now, four attacks, sitting on threes, re-rolling. Oh, one. two misses. Got three hits now, though. Two's to wound, re-rolling one of them. Re-roll the one. Three. 
Insta kills. So it'll be the close. Oh, we gotta take the closest first, Oink. but I guess it'll work out for that. One, two, three. And then they pile in initiative two, and they're gonna hit him back. Hitting on fives. Oh, of course, lots of hits. Hitting on fives. Oh, one. Just, just one wound. <laughs> I have this, two plus. It is good, but if he had failed that, they have Entropic Touch, which means that he would lose his armor save if he had failed it, but he did not. And then piling in. Oddly, I and a Space Marine turn four, so we're nearing the end, because turn five could be the end, although we still have Necron's turn four. Davicus charges in and burninates two and a half Scarab Swarms and then spears three more of them. Don't know how a spear kills a bunch of Scarabs, but hey, rules. We got it. Okay. He skews them. That's right, skewer. <laughs> skewer. And these brave Space Marines threw themselves up against the Immortals just to tie them up so they couldn't keep tessellating everybody because these guys have proven to be incredibly effective at shooting and killing lots of guys. And uh, so the Space Marines are pushing forward, holding the Necrons back, but there's still plenty of Necron firepower on this side of the table as we go into Necrons, turn four. A regroup, double one. <gasps> no, and they're off the table. There's no roll you could make that doesn't take them off the table. Just a good thing, because they're the Terminator killer. And then both of these are within six inches, so does he lose a wound? Yes, does he lose a wound? No. So two more Scarab Swarms, bloom, right into combat. So both the spiders are down to two wounds. Do you see him at all, that group? No. Sh shouldn't be able to, no. He survived the hit. Yeah. And in the shooting phase, because he's only got two things that can fire and they can't see anything, which was the idea. So straight to the assault phase. So starting here, two attacks from the Space Marines. Four is to hit. One up. And then 13 attacks into the Space Marine. Four is to hit. Oh, just about half. The wound. Oh, that's more than half armor and one dies which means he loses combat by one i don't think it matters which weapon dies i think this is an all or nothing thing leadership down to seven. Oh, he holds the lone marine is holding his ground just turn on the flamer buddy just turn on the flamer and then davicus with his three attacks threes to hit oh and then twos to wound re-rolling one of them oh three insta kills so three scarab swarms get speared sure problem this side and the scarabs hit back. 12 attacks hitting on fives. Woo! Ooh, only four. Fives. One. He's good. End of turn four. Davicus just skewering lots of scarab swarms. And that lone marine holding off all the immortals and Caesaris by himself as the, the, the spiders take cover behind some of the generators. That seems safe, right? Hide behind the generators as everybody shoots at you. As we go into possibly the last turn, Space Marines! Turn five. Stern guard moving up six inches towards the center objective. Like a boss. Scouts are gonna move up because they can't shoot anything right now, and they might as well get a better position for when you do kill this one space marine, because I do expect him to die. Never know, he might survive. Running stern guard in the shooting phase five inches, and look at that, look at that, up against the wall. Here, we got it, we got it. Until this humongous spider comes around. <laughs> it's more mechanical. Scout's gonna run six inches. Look at this. Ooh, look at this console. Beep, beep, boop, boop. Hey, it controls the entire tomb world. And these guns? And those guns. <laughs> that don't work anymore. Just joking. Doesn't do that. All right, this is assault. One attack from the Space Marine. Swings and he hits. And it doesn't hurt because he's a little surrounded. So it's kind of like a short swing. So he's and he's just—he's kind of scared. Yeah, he knows, he knows fear right now in this fear. moment. That's what it is. But we'll see. We'll yes, see. Maybe we'll promote him to sergeant he if he survives right this. If he doesn't die, he had a problem. It's embarrassing yes. for the yes. world. A little bit embarrassing. So 13 Three attacks days. from the immortals. Uh oh, uh, 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 that's a lot of. Well, no, no, that's that's about half. Forced to wound. Oh, just two. Just two. Can you do it? Can you do it? He is getting promoted to sergeant. Sergeant with the flamer, that's allowed, right? And then Davicus, three attacks hitting on threes. He hit, can he kill all three of them? And he does! No! Oh, single-handedly skewers a bajillion scarab swarms as he then runs six inches. And he moves towards the center objective. 
And of Space Marines turn five, the Necrons are actually getting pushed back. This one lone Space Marine actually probably turning the entire tide of the battle. Davicus is pretty awesome too, killing those Scarabs, but he's holding off a lot of firepower that would go into the scouts or probably into the Stern Guard to secure this objective. So we go into Necron, turn five, which is possibly the last turn. Spiders are moving up. They have to kill Davicus and all the Stern Guard in order Spider to grab that. Spider <laughs> in order to grab the center objective. Blast in the Stern Guard. That's a direct hit. It's, a hit. it's all four of them. Two's to wound. Four wounds. It's AP5, those three up armor. Oh, they survive it! Yeah, this guy is gonna fire at them as well. Oh, oh that's gonna be off. There, but... It ends up right about here. This guy is gonna charge these guys who, well, they can choose to overwatch. They want to overwatch. If he fails the charge, you could overwatch the other guy, but he's pretty close. I think he's like six oh, or seven oh, inches. Oh, that's true. And he will overwatch. But he's in the get hot ammunition. That's how you lost the guy before. Oh, we should have rolled them separately. That's true, but we didn't. So I'll just roll the armor save on that one. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. So no hits. Needs six inches for the charge, and he gets in. No problem. Nine inch charge. Goodbye, spider. Says that. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, as it walks by him. Yeah. And this guy's spider will charge, needs a three inch charge, and he's he's good. Look at one of those dice. We're gonna start with this assault. One space marine, swings, hits on a four, wounds, wounds on a four. Nothing. <laughs> it's just too short, I'm telling you. Got yeah, everybody hitting back on fours. Not bad. Hitting on fours. Well, four wounds, five, three plus save. Oh, There's no. Four. He finally gets his face stomped in. Now, Cesarus is very interested in that specimen who lasted so long. It's going to have to pick him apart to find out why. And they consolidate five inches. And they're going to consolidate back to their objective. Because that would be a really poor tactics not to grab that one. Because then it doesn't matter what happens to the middle one, as the Space Marines have first blood. Then we have this attack. So we have two Hammer of Wrath. We'll start with this one on this side. Wounds on a two. We have a three up armor save. This is your power fist. Oh, that hits the sergeant who can look out sir on a four plus. Here's good. Just kills a nearby one. So this guy will die. He's the nearest. On the other side, nothing. nothing. Two ones doesn't matter. So those two guys in there. So one guy on him. Yep. Yes. Yeah, Change of that. These two will attack this guy. Hitting on threes. Two hits, wounding on sixes, nothing. Start with this spider, who will kill the sergeant first. Three attacks on the charge, hit on fours, and hits twice, wounding on twos, no saves. Ouch. So two lookout sirs on the sergeant, and he oh. dies, as well as somebody else. So two guys go down, and then we have the other spider. Other spider hits on fours, one hit, wounds on a two to kill the last guy, and he kills him. And the stern guards go down again. Consolidating. And consolidating on both the spiders. First one. Back one here. Four inches, and the second one, three inches. So they're definitely contesting this objective. Davicus won't be able to take both of them. And that is the end of turn five. So the Stern Guard got pummeled after their long walk. The one guy blows up in his face. He's like, ha, 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 ha. we got it, guys. Spiders. Ha, ha. And then they died. So currently, the score is there's an objective on each side. And this one is contested. So that's two points for each side, plus first blood for Space Marines. So the score is currently three to two. It is random game length, so we'll see if the game continues. If it does, the Necrons could still win, because now those Immortals are free to start firing, and killing Davicus won't be too, too hard. But if it doesn't continue, then Space Marines do win. On a three plus, the game continues! Oh, and we're going to turn six. <laughs> Davicus is going to move right there an inch away. Shooting phase, four bolters there. I'm gonna fire into that spider. You got threes, two, and wounded on sixes. Hey, One. it's a wound, Dave. He's good. Oh. Snipers, three regular ones first into the spider, hitting oh. on fours. Yeah. Two hits, wounded on fours. Oh, we got an AP2. Four up cover. He's good. Sergeant on a three. Oh, crack missile on a four. Oh, and the spider remains unharmed. Gauntlet, heavy flamer, wound. Nope. Salt phase, charge. I don't think I get to roll for that, but hey, what? Scare! It's all covered in the scarab stuff, so it should scare the spider. So it's got two wounds. You've got four attacks. You hit on threes. You get to reroll. Oh, we got four hits, but you only wound on fours. 
You need two of these. Rerolling one. You get to reroll one. Can you kill the spider? Oh! oh! He slices and dices. This spider is dead. And consolidates three inches. Where do you want to put him? Yeah. Good idea. And so the end of Space Marines, turn six. The snipers and the guys over there were unable to do anything, but Davicus single-handedly just ran up to a spider, shoved a spear through its head, ripped it off, and added it to his collection of all the scarab stuff that he has around his belt now. We're gonna make a big belt of scarab swarms, uh, just to represent how awesome he is. And then he hides behind the generator so the Tesla guys can't fire at him as all the lightning stuff goes around him and he's getting ready to jump out to kill the other spider. As we go to Necrods, turn six. Spider! Keep Where's it going? Three. Where, where, where are you going? What? Yeah. What? There's a cover save, but still can test. And... Immortals are moving forward. Maybe you can shake him off the other generator. Because if you can do that, then he'll have more objectives. Playing the long game. Actually, no, this would win him this turn. If he got it. If he, he gets didn't. it. Yeah. If he fails it, then, well, he's in trouble. Spider is going to fire into these guys. Oh, three mm -hmm. inches. Nothing. I forgot that it's twin links. That could have mattered last turn too, but you killed them. Oh, there we go. Five of them. You're welcome. Two's to hit. Or two's to wound. Five wounds. Three up armor. One dies. It could have been much worse. And seven of these guys are in range to fire their Tesla weapons at these guys. Two's to hit. Sixes are three. That's a uh, nine out of seven hits. Three's to wound. Oh no! Oh no! If he kills all of them. Oh, he doesn't have the objective! Three die! Oh, the sergeant remains! The sergeant remains, but you have a lance! You got the lance. lance! It's hit every time so far, even on Overwatch. Okay. Three's, one time misses. three's a hit! Oh yeah, it's two's, two's the wound. wound! It's a wound! Four up cover. It's all down to a 50-50 die roll. How do you like that? 50-50 die roll. <laughs> if, if this, like, fails, you buy me chicken wings? I will buy you chicken wings if it fails. All right. <laughs> Oh! I wanted chicken wings! <laughs> <laughs> oh, man. But he might still run. He might. Because that is all the shooting. So leadership nine, because he's a veteran sergeant. Mm -hmm. If he fails this, he will be running, and that'll lose you the game as well. Go get him, hit it. Whoa. No, no, that's after he fails. That's regrouping, and he doesn't have to worry about because he's a special brain, and that's they right. just, they just <sighs> ignore those rules. That was, that was a worthy effort. That yeah. was. And if we go into turn seven, you can still do it. Yes, I can. End of turn six, so the score is still three to two for the Space Marines. I got this one. And the game is a 50-50 chance to go to turn seven. So on a four plus, the game continues. <laughs> oh! oh! Practice roll, practice roll, practice roll. Everybody gets one. Oh! Two practice rolls, two practice rolls. Oh! Oh! Yay! 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 <laughs> All right, guys, hug and make up. Space Marine victory! So Davicus, woohoo! He sure made up for last game where he just kind of charged into something and died. <laughs> <laughs> By single-handedly like holding this entire flank. He ran in and killed all those warriors with one Terminator yeah, helping him. pretty BA, man. Yes, and then killing all those scarabs, and then killing a spider, and then holding, or contesting that objective in the middle. Like he, yeah, he, he won this game. Except for the, the first blood as well was a good contribution. Which who got the first blood? It was the snipers killing that thing, right? Yeah. So that was awesome. So go snipers, go Davicus. Everybody else was good. Stern guard kind of ran around like a muck and, and then the died. One guy there. Oh, and the one guy. And the immortal squad, I think they should get a pat on the metal back as well. They can shoot. They can shoot. Fight. Yeah, they should. Well, yeah, that's, that's Necrons in a nutshell right there. Necrons <laughs> in a nutshell. Yeah. Necrons in a nutshell. Very crunchy metal nutshell. Uh, yeah, because they killed the Terminators, and then they killed Tacticals, and then they overwatched and killed other guys, and then they almost wiped out that squad. Like, yep, seriously, yep. like they killed a lot of guys. It was a close game. So, incredibly close. So, thank you very much for watching. Click the link below to go and watch Mission 2B, where we're going to see Commissar Khrushchev with his new sculpt. He's got a new arm that he's, he's grabbed from the Tyranid Prime that he killed in Storms of Ixia, and we're going to see a nice big 2,000-point game that where Overlord Kanum is nice. personally going to lead the charge and as a counterattack against the Space Marines who are mounting an assault against one of the Null Field Matrix pylons. So go ahead, click the link below. If you're not a Vault member, of course, you're free to click it anyways and just sign up for a seven day free trial. Help support us, help speed Steve. I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> well, I thought you said help speed Steve. No, feed, feed, feed Steve. That's a tongue twister. Feed Steve. <laughs> Helps feed Steve. Say that fast. Helps feed just, Steve. Just help me eat. I'm hungry. Just help me eat. Yeah. <laughs> Chicken wings. Yeah. And it also allows us to make videos, of course. That's important, too. So, thanks for watching, and happy wargaming.